Hello everybody, this is Drew Naylor, and welcome back to another episode of Luigi's Mansion. Previously, we, um, captured the final portrait ghost, asterisk, um, not really the final one, because there's one more, well, it's the final one as far as our Game Boy Horrors, uh, ghost screen is concerned. And we captured the two final um, boos for the game. The entire game, 50 out of 50. And we got, um, for that, we got a gold diamond. And we also got the key to area. No, oh no, oh no, oh no, okay. Um, we also got to the key to area, air quotes, five area five like that which just like put air quotes in it as you say it like like put quotes as you say the phrase area five kind of put quotes around the five because it's not really an area although we do get a um key for it as you can see up here it's not really an area well since we get a key for it i'm just gonna call it area five so yeah But I think I might be a little bit nervous um, because today we're actually gonna fight the final boss. Wow, what happened there with the dust? Hmm. Strange, but today we're actually gonna fight the final boss for the game. what we have to do is go in here in this winding hallway and we walk up to the door and it, um, the barrier goes away and then whew, very quite a scary um, door artwork don't you think so yeah, now we can open the door. Hmm, that doorknob artwork also looks kind of um, final boss-like, wouldn't you say? Oh, it's King Boo. Like I ex like I didn't expect that. And as you can see, for that, we got another sapphire. Um. Mario's painting right there, as I said earlier in this uh, project. Um, that's not how it's supposed to look. I mean, it's supposed, it's supposed to. Oh, gold bar! Yeah, I got it. It's supposed to look a lot um, more. Um, I wonder if I can get more. Um, it's a, supposed to a lot of look a lot more. Um, Hmm, what's the word? Uh, I can't really think of it right now. But we can walk over here. And we can see that there's actually more. It's supposed to be more blurry. Ah, okay. I was almost going to check this. As you can see, if, if you really need to, you can also go back to the beginning right now to um yeah I'm gonna go back and save my what um and the audio for that sound effect cut out too I'm just gonna save so that I don't have to get my um items back or my um money back if I um if I get a game over. Where do I go? Down here. So yeah, I'm gonna meet you back there. Some health. Go! 
gold bar. Woohoo. Nice. Huh. I'm gonna go save and then um, go back down there again. Ooh, another gold bar. I knew I sh I knew that it would be a good idea to look in here. Oh. Now we can go back to face the um, final boss because I got um, quite a bit of um, because I got some gold. That's nice, and I wanted water. Oh well. What's this? Wait a minute. Well, I didn't find anything in there. Now we're actually gonna go face the final boss fight. Or face the final boss. Okay. It's in here. Or I'm on the proper level. stuck here. Oh well. I don't know how um, it was possible for um, the regular size Luigi to get um, in there but not uh, Luigi when he was small. Doesn't really make any sense. And now because I don't have any water I can't put out these um, ghosts. just have to run toward the door and open it. And now we go down here. If you don't have 50 or if you don't have at least 45 of out of 50 or 40 out of 50 of the boost in the American version, in the NTSC version of Luigi's Mansion, or if you don't have at least 45 out of 50 of the boost in the PAL version, you cannot um, go further than like right here because you'll be pushed all the way back to the, I think the entrance, maybe. I don't really remember. Like I said, it's been a while. And now, we walk up. we can do it on this side. Yep, we can. Okay. Hmm. We weren't over there just a second ago. 
Now this is King Boo. Ah, I could just stare at my Mario painting for hours. It's true what they say about fine art. It takes utterly refined sensibilities to truly appreciate it. The way you plead for help, Mario. I find it so satisfying. Perhaps that is merely because I remember how much trouble you caused me in the past. Seriously though, who would actually believe that mansions get given away in contests? Talk about S-T-U-P-I-D. What do they feed you Mario Brothers anyway? Gullible soup? Your Mario, your, bro your brother came all this way just to get turned into a painting. It's just terrific. However, this Mario painting looks lonely. I must have a Luigi painting as well. Then my gallery will truly be complete. <laughs> I am not afraid of you. I fear only that this infernal poultry gas 3000 you carry on your back. Um, STUPID machine. But I am a king among booze, I sweat. I shall fear no, fear no mere house cleaning device. I must say, despite the way you shwerp shloop, world shlurred, vacuumed up all my friends. <sighs> Don't imagine that I'll flee. I'll fight you like a true boo. Now join your brother. Inside the painting. Now this looks kind of weird. Interesting. Oh, that's Bowser. Interesting. Oh, well, I mean, technically it's Mario's painting, but it's a painting that changes from Mario, or from Mario, yeah, Mario to Bowser, kind of like the, um, um, painting for Bars Bowser in the Dark World in Mario 64. Um, yeah, how it changes from Peach to Mario. Okay. Now, this is Bowser. And I really like this boss fight because um, it's really, oops, oh, good start. Oh no, it's really unique for a Mario boss fight. because you don't really expect um, Bowser, or um, you don't really expect um, this, basically what this boss fight is, and just basically how you have to use the uh, Poltergust in um, basically against um, Bowser, it's just well, Bowser and King Boo. Well, more like Bowser. Or more like just King Boo. Because there's a lot of theories, like, um, that King Boo actually, um, oops. King Boo actually, um, reincarnated Bowser. Or reanimated Bowser. Um, but that's. A lot of people are just saying, oh, it's just because um, King Boo is a boo. Whoops. Um, so that's why. Or King Boo is the king of the boos, just like King Bowser is King Koopa, king of the Koopas. So there's just a bunch of them in the uh, arm in Bowser's army so yeah so uh, that was basically that theory is just that Bowser is allowing King Boo to um, fight Luigi with a uh, suit of Bowser made with Bowserium
Now, um, the only way to restore health in this boss fight is to have Bowser um, run into um, these things right here, the um, pillars. There we go. And we got King, we defeated King Boo and Bowser. And without uh, King Boo to control the Bowser suit, Bowser suit just, the Bowser suit just falls over. And with 43 health, we have completed it. Hmm? Curse, Luigi. Luigi, you did it. Truly remarkable, my boy. I suppose the I supplied the Pultricus 3000, but you ran with it all the way to the top, Sonny. You made me proud, so you made me so proud. Get a hold of yourself, Gad. What's that? You found King Boo? He jumped into a <sighs> painting of Bowser, you say? He even blew fire at you. Well, well, in all my years of ghost research, I've never heard of such a fantastic tale. And that career spanned 60 years, mind you. Why, I still recall starting out as a young, uh, well, who trembled at the mere thought of a ghost. Trembled, I say. Oh, beg your pardon. This old brain goes recollecting, recollecting every now and then. I could sit down and fill a week spinning ghost yarns. Why, just last. Right, well, anywho, Luigi. Luigi, grab your brother's painting and bring him to the lab. <laughs> the poor little feather's fallen asleep. He must have just collapsed with relief and exhaustion when he saw you arrive. Uh, get the machine ready to return your brother to his uh, former state, alrighty? I'll be expecting you both. And now, um, we'll take Mario's painting off the wall. It's blurred like it should be. And... Now, Luigi will go back to the lab. This'll mess with your head. All your hard work lasted only a single night. Well done, Luigi. The mansion those booze built disappeared into the night, but the, that treasure seems to be real. I have no interest in such stuff, so go on and keep it all. Use it however you like. Say what? Enough rattling on about money? I guess we'd better... Get your brother back, then. Of course. Your brother is really important. But first, we have to take care of these ghosts. So these are the portrait ghosts that we got. Well, okay, I guess there's only... It looks like there's only two. Uh, King Boo and the Bowser suit. Um, but there's, I think it's also all the other portrait ghosts for this area. Maybe not. The ghosts are invisible. No, I can clearly see Bowser's head and King Boo. Ba both Bowser's face and King Boo's face. And yeah, I got a browns. I figured. Yep. Well, I think it is browns. Yeah, this is all the um, ghosts for this, um, for Area 4. Yeah, it didn't do that great, but that's okay. Hmm. I'd wager, wager dollars to donuts that nobody but me has such lovely paintings. <laughs> now we get to see who we've caught, or well, who as in who, which ghosts that we caught and then we get to see um all the money that we've gotten in our rank eventually king boo is how it shows up we've caught a total of 23 ghosts Yes, I got it. Nice. Um, I got the best rank, I'm pretty sure. 
Yeah, I want to save. And now, as you can see, that number one right by our save file, that means that we've completed, I think we've completed the game one time on this file. I think that's what that means. And now we run Mario through the reverse process. <laughs> just the music is just kind of funny as it speeds up. It's probably not very comfortable though, to be honest. And now Mario gets sent through a pipe, which, I mean, he should be used to that by now. He he does that. He gets sent through pipes all the time. So. Although Mario's head is stuck in a uh, vent, he appears to be okay. And um, Luigi is um, overwhelmed that Mario is safe. Well, that project was really fun. This Let's Play was a really fun one to do. Um, I'm actually recording this one at 1.38 a.m. on October 22nd, 2016. Um, obviously, it's going to be, this particular episode is going to be released in ooh, late November, maybe even December. I'm not too sure. But it was a really fun one to make and it was really fun to put together and um, let me know what you want me to if you want me to if you want to see me play any more games uh, preferably Nintendo games well I mean not preferably Nintendo games but preferably um, games that um, can be played on the computer on the PC which includes um, emulation um, as long as I have the ROM for that like uh, as long as I can huh the sound effects are really interesting as long as I um hmm I don't know how to say it um, as long as it's easy to record I can do it like Luigi's Mansion I dumped the ROM myself um, I also have a few more ROMs that I also dumped myself for uh, GameCube and Wii games, and I have a whole bunch more GameCube and Wii games that I have that I have not dumped yet. Also, um, a, an easy game to let's play, I mean it would take a while, an easy game to let's play would be um, Super Mario 64. Um, now, Luigi's Mansion, though. And so the matter of the ghosts was settled. Professor Egad was so delighted to have all of his paintings returned that he used the treasure that Luigi had found to build Luigi a new house. I wonder what it is. And it is... Congratulations! Your mansion is complete! Yay! Rank A. Yeah. And now we get a nice, beautiful painting of the new mansion. The end. Okay. Now, Luigi's Mansion was a really short game. And I used 113,140,000 gold. Okay. I used it to test the waters of um, basically Let's Playing to see how well I could do with one. And, um... It seemed to turn out pretty good. I'm actually going to go back into the game and um, actually go to the gallery. Um, as you can see, all of the... Uh, oh, you can actually go to the gallery and see your... Um, you can actually see the... Um, see your mansion, your new mansion at the end. Um, As I, as I um, go through the gallery, 
are um, um, well, okay, I'm not gonna go through every picture, but we can actually open, oh, there's nothing, okay. Um, I um, think that we should go into here. And by going up to here, 23, it says 23 because this is the 23rd portrait ghost. And that is King Boo and the Bowser suit. That actually sounds like a um, like the name of a book or something. <laughs> Wouldn't be surprised if there's like a fan fiction out there with that name or something. <laughs> yeah, and um, if you actually and here's Bulasis actually. Ah, oh, that's interesting. That one's made out of, uh, I mean, all these are made out of pixels, but that one especially looks like it. It's interesting. Huh. I wonder, are the other silver ones? No. Okay, where are the other area portrait ghosts? Hmm. Yeah, all the, um, area of portrait ghosts seem to have like an interesting um, effect on them. Mm -hmm. eh, except that one. Okay, so one, um, two, three, okay, so there are four. Four. Um, area portrait ghosts. All of them have like a unique different style to them. Now go ahead and suggest something for me to play in the comments section down below. Um, I'll see if I uh, can. Um, I'll see if I can do that. Um, I have I haven't um, I have a ROM of Mario 64 in my possession that I can play. If I want, if um, people want to watch me play uh, Mario 64, I can play that. Or I can play like a ROM hack or something. Um, as long as it's, uh, as long as the game is appropriate for all ages, then I'll play it. Or like not like rated E or E10 Tina's a little pushing it um, preferably it will be kept in E or E10 um, yeah but it just it depends on what the content descriptors are like um, Brawl is rated teen but the content descriptors don't have anything that should actually make the teen rating like closer to an M rating, if that makes sense. But this was a really fun game to play. And um, Luigi's Mansion actually started out as a GameCube tech demo, so I'm really glad that they decided to extend it into a full game. Um, I don't really know what else to say, um, but I did this all within the span of, let me see. I've got my um, raw files right here. Okay, episode one's raw file was created on September 25th, 2016, and I've been working on this video series since. Um, I've been working on it since uh, July, just after I um. Just after I, um, actually, yeah, when I post, I'm going to, in the description, I'm going to post that video that I, uh, said, and I'm not going to do a video until, like, October, or in, for a few months. Um, this is a pretty long episode, but, um, 
I'm not going to do an episode for or a video. I said that I wasn't going to do a video for a few months. Um, and that was like at the end of July. And then I practiced Luigi's Mansion for two days. Well, a few hours. Over two days I completed um, Area 1. During that, just testing it just to see how it would work. And um, yeah. I think this series turned out pretty good. If you've got any questions for me, uh, leave them down in the in the comment section, and I will try to answer them. Um, I don't know if there's going to be a bonus video minus the failed attempt at um, fighting Bowser, or the final boss, King Boo, and the Bowser suit. Um, there was a failed attempt of it at it and I'm not sure I think that's gonna be a, a bonus episode and maybe if anybody has any questions for me about this project I can answer them in that episode as well um, as well as a test episode I mentioned way back in like episode 3 or something so um, thank you so much for watching this entire series I don't know what I'm gonna do next for I don't know if I'm gonna do another game next I don't know when my next video is going to go out other than after Luigi's Mansion is finished um, I kind of want to work on programming for my application launcher um, I kind of want to work on that for a little while to get that working um, for my uh, version 3 of that I really want to get working on that and um, so yeah there's just so much for me to talk about so I think that's enough so um, thank you very much for watching this entire series it was a lot of fun and I had a lot of fun working on it and recording it so thank you for watching it goodbye <laughs>